Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, it's been a little while and I'm really sorry I haven't been posting lately. I've had some issues with my hard drive on my previous computer and actually some issues with my computer in general. Um, essentially what's happening is my hard drive is slowly failing. Um, so I've had to kind of remove all my stuff and make sure that I've double backed up everything um, because it's getting harder and harder to extract information from the hard drive so it's yeah it's a bit of a sad time for me because um, my PC is just really it's getting on to nearly seven eight years old now um, so I thought it was time for an upgrade and I finally purchased something that I've been wanting for a really long well, not really long, but for quite a while. And it's uh, something that I feel like it's going to be really beneficial for my business overall and, and beneficial for my work. And it's been a while since I've actually had a laptop, but I've actually purchased the Microsoft Surface Book. So I'll just give you guys a big look there. Uh, and I love it so far. It's all I've been using over the last couple of days. And the reason I've gone to a laptop is because I have plans to actually do a bit of traveling towards the end of the year. And I still want to be able to do photography on the go and, and to edit my photos on the go. And especially at the moment going between Sydney and Melbourne, going back to visit family during those times, I haven't been able to edit anything really. I've up, up until this point I've had to just wait until I've gotten back to Melbourne. This is this is going to be a little bit more helpful though because if I do move at the end of the year and I and I do start to travel a little bit more, um, my PC is probably going to be in storage. Uh, so it's going to be really helpful to have something portable that I can use to edit my photos. So I think maybe some of you might be wondering why I chose the Surface Book over maybe a Mac product. And I don't really want this to go into a whole war about PC versus Mac or whatever. Um, but because honestly, I think both offer really, really great things in terms of things for creative people. Um, but I did choose this specifically because I'm really used to working on a PC and, um, with Windows, Microsoft. So it's just something that I've, I've had my whole life. So I'm really used to working with it. And I just really loved the idea of the Surface Pro because I can actually detach the screen and I'll show you guys um, what actually happens. So I'll just open it up. So I've got it just like this. So here I've detached the screen and that actually turns into a tablet, um, which is really cool. And I can actually use the Surface Pen to edit my photos directly onto the tablet part. Uh, which is going to be so so helpful for when I'm traveling and I need to do things on the go and I don't have to bring my graphics tablet with me everywhere I go and it's all in one like it's really really easy to use so that was a really big selling point for me um, in getting it apart from the fact that it's got some pretty good reviews and and not only that it's it's very light so it's going to be really easy for me to take it wherever I need to. It's such a nice product and I'm really really excited to get more use out of it because I haven't over the last few days. It's really just been transferring everything across from my, my other computer. Um, and I don't think I'll probably do like um, a proper review on this either because honestly I don't know that much about computers and I think if I was to give a review on it you'd probably be getting information that was just not maybe correct or it probably sounds a bit stupid so uh, I think I'll probably leave that to professionals to do that and I'm sure there's plenty of them on YouTube already But yeah, I mean I can let you guys know how it goes anyway and um, Maybe if there's any specific features that kind of pop up which I'm really impressed by I can definitely let you guys know about it Or if you had any questions about it or about using it that would be totally fine if I was to answer some of those questions But yeah, this is my new computer. So I'm really excited. I'm gonna finally be able to edit hopefully um once the rest of the stuff's finished transferring over. I'm going to be working mainly from hard drives now um, because the internal storage on this one's 512 gigabytes, I think. But, which which is a fair amount, but I think it's just going to be easier for me to have everything on hard drives now and start backing up a lot better, um, especially ever since the um, issue with my previous hard drive. And, I mean, I could go and get my PC fixed and, and get new parts for it, but... 
like I said, it's probably going to be in storage at the end of the year and I needed something that was going to be portable anyway. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's not very long and it's probably not that informative, but I thought I'd just let you guys know where I'm at with my new computer and what I just purchased. Uh, I will hopefully have some more videos up very soon, hopefully in the next couple of weeks. So until then, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!